Welcome to day 14 of our 21 day DAX challenge. Today we are measuring customer performance for a specific year. Which customer generated the most sales in 1997? Now this is perfect for historical sales analysis and let's solve it step by step with DAX function. Okay, let's begin. So first thing what we can do is we will just create a new measure and understand the question it says which customer. So we have to understand the name of the customer, the sales and the year. There are multiple criteria which are given here. So let's start with writing and creating a virtual table. So the first thing we'll write down the name of this function or the uh, measure would be top customer in 1997 equals to very first thing remember we'll create a variable table equals to t and in that table we don't want all the columns we want only specific columns that we want values which gives us the customer id okay comma then we also need something given as sales 1997 then we have missed the bracket, so I'll just close the bracket over here. The sales 1997 is a column name, but what do I want in that particular um, column, sales 1997? So I want here the total sales. Remember total sales we have calculated in the previous videos. Then we can just put here comma, but the criteria here is something different. So we want to filter the data based on the order date. Okay, now the order date which is required here, it should be equal to 1997. Now, this is the major condition we require. So, what are the things we require? We need a customer ID column. We need a sales column. But the sales is not only total sales. It is a sales for the year 1997. That's a condition. Moving further, now what we need is we need the maximum sales. So, we'll just create a variable which says as max sales and equals to. Uh, the function is straightforward. We'll just type as max. T stands for the virtual table. And the sales 1997 is the table, uh, is a column which we have created in the previous example. The next one, we'll try to find out the top customer ID. Okay, the top customer ID would be what? When we type here a max function, now we want to filter the table. Which table? The virtual T table. On which column? On the sales 1997. Okay, and the condition is that it should be equal to the max sales option. Okay and also based on the customer ID. So we select the option as customer ID option here. Now, once we have done this, we got the maximum sales, we got the top customer ID, and now we don't want the customer ID, we want the customer name, or let's say the company name. So how do we get it here? We will just type here return, and uh, in the return, we will add a lookup value. Remember, we filtered customer ID and the sales. We have not got the customer name. So here we can write down, let's say the company name and based on the customer ID, okay. And this customer ID should match with the thing which we selected right now is the top customer ID, okay. Now this will give me the final answer. So carefully observe, T stands for the virtual table, maximum sales, we got the max sales, top customer ID give us the first customer ID, which is the uh, maximum value. With the help of same top customer ID, we match in the customer table and got the company name. So the name is top customer 1997. Once we do that, we can go back here. Top customer 1997, we got the output Taylor Swift. So the person who has uh, given uh, maximum sales, I can say it's the Taylor Swift in the year 1997. So if you want for different years, you keep on changing the value over here. You change to 1998, 2000 or anything. So here, if you carefully observe, we are going little detail in the direction. We first got the customer, second thing was the sales and third was the condition that is 1997. So multiple things we are adding in this particular function in the challenge over here. So I hope you have understood the challenge 14 for finding out the uh, top customers in the year 1997. In the next video, in the challenge 15, we'll try to solve a function or a question over here. Which customer placed the most orders in any single month? We want to find out the name of that customer. So we'll see this answer in the next video for challenge 15.